guys, it's Patrick. It is uh, Thursday. Um, my last update was last Friday when I think I told you that I was feeling a little bit sick. I was taking a day off of work. Um, that uh, sick day actually turned into about a sick week. I was out with a terrible cold all weekend. Um, fevers, chills, just felt awful. Um, and I took a couple of days off of work this week as well, which is something that I don't really do that often. Um, I was laid out flat on the couch. Um, one of the things that I wound up doing was uh, catching up on YouTube and I saw a whole bunch of guys uh, updating, which is great, especially a bunch of new guys, a bunch of, um, you know, I say new guys like I'm, I've been at this for a while, um, but guys that I haven't seen uh, when I was doing all the searches earlier, trying to find uh, people who were updating with their hair. Um, so people who are just starting out their new journey, like, you know, I've decided to grow my hair, so I'm going to track my progress from day one. And people who um, are like me, who waited quite a while and then said, you know, here's my progress so far and I'll keep up with you um, up till then, um, which is great. Um, also, uh, subscribe to a bunch of channels that are have nothing to do with hair or are sort of ancillary to hair. There's uh, one woman who has um, a condition where she pulls her hair out, um, which is, it just seems terrifying. Um, and, but she's really brave. She's a young woman and she, it's her journey is really quite brave where she talks about, um, how, uh, difficult it is and how hair is so important. And then I feel like, well, you know, hair is so important to those of us growing it too. Um, but we don't have, suffer from any sort of, um, illness, which, you know, so it makes you count your blessings. There are also a lot of people who, uh, go to the store, especially the dollar store, and they buy a whole bunch of stuff and then they get on camera and they show you all the stuff that they bought, which at first I thought, who the hell, who, who wants to watch all of that? You know, why would anybody want to watch you opening up bags of stuff that you bought at the dollar store? And then on my 33rd video, watching someone talk about the organizing baskets and thinking, oh my God, I could go to the dollar store and I could buy organizing baskets and I could fill out oh, my linen closet could be so organized. I, and I realize why people do that. So don't judge. Um, and I try not to judge anybody um, on YouTube. Um, and that leads me to, segue, leads me to a couple of folks uh, who have been updating about their hair, um, did uh, videos about the fact that they've cut their hair. And it's almost like it's a script. Um, you see someone who they turn on the camera and they, they look down and they look really sad and they say, Hey guys, it's me. Just wanted to let you know that I've, I've cut my hair because, and then you get the reasons, which are, you know, they're perfectly normal reasons for cutting your hair. Um, you know, you have a job interview, you have school pictures. If you're a younger person, you know, you may have your school pictures. You don't want to have the, the awkward stage pictures. Um, there's uh, someone in your life who would prefer you with short hair and you like them better than you care about your hair. Um, and the main thing that that these guys usually say in these videos is, I, I'm so sorry, I know you're disappointed in me. Um, I just wanted to put it out there that this is a really really uh, non-judgmental community. It's really great. I mean, you know, I would expect by now that there would be someone uh, from the community who's on the comments saying you're way too old to grow your hair out uh, at, a, at your age at 46. That's just crazy. I mean, you know, who the hell does that? But they're not. Everybody's really cool. Everybody's really, um, really just friendly and encouraging no matter where you are. And if you cut your hair, that's your choice. That's something you need to do. Uh, for whatever reason, maybe it was a mistake. Maybe you feel like it's a mistake the second you put down the clippers or you walk out of the barber shop, you say, oh my God, what did I do? Well, the cool thing is, is that you can grow it again, um, especially if it's the day after, especially if you're still a young person who has hair, um, you can just start growing it again, you know? I mean, it doesn't mean that you have reduced or re removed the ability to grow hair. Um, maybe later in life, you won't be able to grow your hair as, as well or as full or, or even at all. Um, I know a lot of guys my age, uh, my, the guys who I graduated with, most of them don't have a lot of hair left or um, a lot of them have, you know, the male pattern baldness where it's, you know, they've got the crown or they've got it around here. So I consider myself lucky to be able to grow it. But I don't think anybody's disappointed in you if you have, um, if you've decided to cut your hair. So I just wanted to put that out there that um, uh, much like 
the last time when I talked about the awkward stage about uh, don't don't judge yourself too harshly for um, for looking like you're in an in-between stage. I would also say if you decide that at any point that you want to cut your hair, that you want to get it shorter, if you decide to dye it purple, if you decide to do anything with your hair, it's, you know, it's hair. Um, I was going to list all the things that are more important than your hair, but that would basically be everything. Um, so anyway, I just wanted to let you know that uh, those of you who are still growing, uh, keep at it. And those of you who have decided to take a break or make a change or just didn't like it, that's cool too. And there's absolutely no reason why you shouldn't keep updating as to what else is going on in your life. Got a ton of passions. I've seen a lot of guys who started out with hair videos who are doing other sorts of videos, which is really cool as well. Um, I think it's a really welcoming community. Um, and I hope that nobody feels like they have to make a, you know, a really deep confession just because uh, they decided to grab the scissors or grab the clippers. Uh, that's all.